Hey y'all. Hey. Um, welcome back to my channel. Um, starting the video off, starting the vlog off in the car again. Good job. Um, I just got off work. Today is Monday, start of the new week. I need to start starting these vlogs on Sunday. Well, I think the last vlog, and I didn't mean to start it yesterday. I just, I don't know, because I did a lot of work yesterday. I was just busy, so I just didn't end up starting the vlog. I think something is, like, wrong with my car. It's just not freaking doing what I need to do. Um, but, oh, shit. Okay, it's been 42 seconds of nothing. Okay, anyways, hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley, if you are new, and if you aren't new, hey girl, thank you for coming back and supporting. Um, so yeah, today is Monday, I'm just getting off work. Uh, it's going to be a great week today. I said today, it's going to be a great week. I'm claiming it now. It's going to be an amazing week. Um, yesterday, I spent time like looking over my analytics. Y'all would have seen that video by now but I spend time looking over my analytics for August and I feel like I am you know I started working on my plan for September so I feel like I'm on a you know I'm gonna have a great month of um, September so yeah this week um, one is a four-day week so I'm super happy about that so I, I'm off work Friday Saturday Sunday and Monday because of the Labor Day holiday so that's amazing um, and then for two I'm going to I'm gonna have a sale this week so I'm hoping that I can get some sales because having a sale doesn't equal sales I know it's a lot going on but like you know you can unless you're giving the shit out for free just because you put it on sale doesn't necessarily mean that people are going to buy it so I'm hoping that I can get some sales I'm kind of just testing stuff out you know just to see what happens you know so the sale is, by the time y'all seeing this, the sale would have been over because it's going to be for this upcoming week. So I'm thinking of having a sale on sets. Looking at my analytics, sets is where currently, due to my the inventory I currently have, sets is where the most of my money is. Sets is the most potential revenue come from sets and come from jumpsuits because that's what I have the most of. I have more sets than anything. And, I, and then secondly, I have more jumpsuits than anything. So, of course, that's where the most revenue is going to lie. So, um, at first, I was thinking of having a sale on jumpsuits just because I just released those new jumpsuits. But I do still want to have a sale on jumpsuits probably later on in the month. But for this week, I'm just going to focus on sets. So... My main focus for the next two weeks is just promoting um, sets, the sets that we do have, and um, tops. Like, I do have a bunch of tops. So, not a bunch, but I have some tops that haven't been moving. So, I'm just going to focus on sets and focus on tops because I really want to get some new inventory. Like, I just feel like I promote the same stuff over and over and over. And that's just because it's not selling. And I don't have enough, like, I don't have enough money to buy to buy new inventory if I'm not selling what I currently have like especially out living out here in California back when I was back home like the cost of living was cheaper back then like and then I was staying like my whole living situation was very cheap because my rent was only $600 so it's like I had less bills so I had kind of like extra money to put into my business so I was had extra money to invest into my business even when I wasn't making sales I you know from my personal job I had extra money to buy inventory that's not the case now i don't have a ton of extra money to put into inventory so i can't buy inventory until i sell something that i already have so i'm not gonna have anything new for september but i'm hoping to be able to have new arrivals for october um i don't necessarily have to be dropping 10 new things like i think for my last drop i dropped five styles um yeah but and that was mainly because my dad helped me out with that one but um yeah i do want to try to drop some new stuff for october so i'm hoping that i can really meet my sales goal for september so that way i'm able to have new arrivals come october but yeah so that was just a whole lot a whole lot of that ain't what i came over here to say i came over here to say i'm thinking about having a sale this week so i really need to prepare 
for it because I kind of just thought about it yesterday as I was looking over my analytics and trying to plan, you know, what do I want to do for the month. Ideally, I would like to be able to plan months ahead and not like <coughs> the month ahead, you know what I mean? But it's okay. We got to start somewhere, right? So... I want to have a sale and I'm thinking of only doing it Thursday, Friday because looking at my analytics and looking at Google Analytics specifically, Thursdays is, Thursday and Fridays are when I have the most activity on the site. Thursday and Fridays is like people on the site all day compared last month. So I just looked at last month's data. So last month's data, Thursday and Friday is when the site is popping. So I'm thinking of having a sale. I was thinking of doing it Thursday, Friday only. I'm trying to decide if I want to do a two-day sale or maybe do a three-day sale Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. I'm not sure how long I'm going to do it. Um, I haven't 100% decided on the length of time the sale is going to be, but I know for sure it's going to be Thursday and Friday. I'm just not sure if it's going to be a two-day or three-day. So anyways, so I need to prepare for the sale, so I need to get my emails ready, um, I need to, you know, get my texts ready. I want to, sorry if my finger was in the way. I want to change up my website um, so that way the sets can be easily accessible on the website, um, like make it on the homepage. And um, yeah, so that's all stuff I need to do before Thursday. So I'm probably going to tonight just focus on doing the website and the email because that's, you know hope that shouldn't be too too hard um the email is not going to be like that extravagant and then especially since i have or just do <sighs> sorry y'all i'm just i got a lot of a lot of stuff to say and then i'm just start saying it too fast but <clears throat> so i want to do two emails on thursday and if it's friday basically do two emails every day of the sale so two emails on thursday two emails on friday um i'm thinking I don't know or maybe like just one email on Thursday and then two emails on Friday and then I'm also going to do a text message on Thursday and then possibly another text message that's why I was thinking of having it um, Tuesday through Sa Tuesday through Saturday because that I can do one text on Thursday one text on Saturday as like a final reminder I didn't want to do a text back to back like I mean I know people be saying Fashion Nova text all the time i need to get on fashion over text list i personally am not on their text list and i really don't shop from them that often because they ain't as cheap as they used to be so but i kind of want to just get on their text list just so i can kind of get a feel of how often they text because you know i don't want to be annoying but i want to make the sale <laughs> so it's like balance <laughs> but yeah so i don't i mean i will text them thursday and friday but you know yeah, I don't know. We'll see uh, how long. I think I think I'm just gonna do Thursday and Friday to test it out and see how that goes, and then maybe I will do Thursday, Friday, Saturday for the jumpsuit sale. You know what I mean? Like, um, we'll kind of just you know, we'll see how it goes. Um, but yeah, so I need to. Oh, I'm spitting. So I kind of plan out my post for the week or for most of the week i think i have it planned up through thursday um so i'm gonna be posting like i said i'm focusing on sets and tops these next two weeks um so i'm just gonna been posting a bunch of my tops and a bunch of my sets so my goal for this week is to sell at least two sets and at least one top is what my goal for this week is with the focusing you know with me focusing on just promoting those products is my goal um i did not post as much as i would have liked to today um so i'm for sure gonna be scheduling a bunch of posts for tomorrow um Ooh, child. i'm sorry okay like i was saying i didn't um i didn't what was I saying? Oh, I didn't post as much as I would have wanted to today. Like, I just did my basic three posts a day. But if I'm trying to make sales, I need to be, like, posting. So, I'm going to be posting. I'm going to make sure I schedule a bunch of posts for next week or for the rest of the week. And then, of course, I'm going to be going overload on Thursday and Friday with the posts to make sure that I um, 
am getting my goal. So, okay, I didn't even tell y'all what the sale was. The sale is going to be buy one set, get one 20% off. So, again, I've never had a sale like that before. Typically, when I have sales, it's just, um, oh, my God. Sorry, y'all. Typically, when I have sales, it's just, I need to get in a different lane, too. Um, hold on real quick. Let me um, switch lanes. Actually, maybe not, because, child, we ain't going nowhere on this highway. But typically, when I have sales, I either do, like, you know whatever percent off the entire site or maybe i'll do like 15 percent off rumpers or you know what i mean like i do stuff like that um i've never really done a buy one get one type of sale i have done bundle deals in the past um i've done bundle like which i think i might <clears throat> bring back to the site um is the bundle deals i'm thinking about doing that bringing that back to the site but i've had um bundle deals in the past where it was like buy two or more and you know and that was actually successful so that's why I was thinking of having a sale like that like buy one get one 20% off or 25% off I haven't decided what the percentage off is going to be just yet it's either going to be 20 or 25% not 100% sure but <clears throat> yeah so that's that one that so yeah, when I get home after I make dinner and stuff, I'm gonna drink some coffee too. Cause I after I eat dinner, like right now I have energy, but then once I actually cook, like I'll be like dead to the world. And then I obviously still need to do work for my second job. So and I still and I don't want to be up like okay, they don't plan on merging anytime soon. And I don't want to be up all night either. So yeah, but. I'm just gonna focus on the road because it's a lot of traffic so I'm gonna focus on the road and I'll pick the phone back up when I after dinner and all that stuff when I actually start working hey y'all so sorry I'm looking crazy this is how I look after work <laughs> um but yeah so I'm back I'm home from work I'm drinking some coffee so I'm feeling real energized um I got this fan on so sorry if y'all can hear that but I just cooked dinner. Uh, I got the dishwasher going, so it might be kind of loud. But um, while I'm cooking dinner, I'm making like a tuna casserole, so it's in the oven right now. But I'm just about to do some work. Uh, watching my girl Lash T. Oh, I love her videos. But yeah, so I'm about to just do some work. Not like business, not work on my business, work for my second job. Cause I gotta make this money and then I can work on my business, unfortunately. So yeah, I'm about to just do this for a little bit and then, and then I'll work on my second job. I mean, and then I'll start doing work for the business. Hey guys, so um, sorry for my appearance. Like during the week, I'll be looking rough. Um, but what else can I say? Oh, today is Tuesday. Um, and I've been home from work for a minute now. I did work for my other job. And, um, yeah, so now I'm about to do some work for, like, myself, my business for a couple hours. And then make lunch for tomorrow because I'm starting keto again tomorrow. And then go to sleep. But first thing I'm going to do is, um, I had a video go live today. So I'm going to respond to some comments well, I literally have two comments to respond to. So let me not even try to make it seem like I'm like a big time YouTuber. <laughs> I'm going to respond to the two comments that I have. Oh, child, my arm is tired. Let me put y'all over here. Okay, I look real rough. I'm so sorry. But I'm going to respond to the two comments that I have. And then I'm going to upload a video tomorrow as well. So I'm going to just make the thumbnail for that. I already have like the description box all of that i just need to make the thumbnail and then schedule it to go live tomorrow and then um what else what i want to do for my business is prep my post for tomorrow i have in my mind i already have i already know what i'm going to post i just need to write the captions out and then i need to make like a, i need i kind of want to edit the website a little bit i just want to make a collection like a fall collection um so I can put a link to that in my bio because it's starting to get a little chilly. So 
yeah, that's what um that's what I'm gonna do tonight. Um that's pretty much all I'm gonna do tonight. And I'm currently watching Captain America 2. Uh, th I think this is like my favorite Marvel movie of them all. I feel like this one is my favorite. Uh, let me know if you've watched all of the Marvel Avenger movies. Which one is your favorite? But yeah, that's what I'm about to do. So I'll probably either maybe talk to y'all later tonight or tomorrow. Hey y'all. So today is Thursday. It's not. I wish. It's Tuesday. No, it's not. I'm not having this shit. Today is Wednesday, child. I'm all over the place. So today is Wednesday. Um, I'm home now from work. And I'm making dinner. Just making some chicken wings because I decided to do keto again. Um, I think I'm just going to do keto for like two weeks. Like I'm going to do two weeks on, two weeks off like each month because I really want to try to lose 10 pounds each month. So basically just do it until I lose 10 pounds and then... I lost my 10 pounds for the month, just take a couple days off just to kind of like, um, just to kind of like refresh and, um, you know, get myself back together. I hate my damn laptop. For some reason, it'd be making me verify it's me when I'm trying to log into like my iCloud or whatever, but yeah, so I'm about to just edit a YouTube video. I posted one today. It's not doing too good. Um, but I am happy that I made um, 200 subscribers. That was my goal was to make 200 subscribers. I don't know if I told y'all this yesterday or not. But it was my goal to make 200 subscribers before September. And I did that. So, um, that was great. So now my goal, one of my goals for September is to reach 300 subscribers. Because I really want to hit... 500 subscribers by the end of the year so i'm about to go hard and continue to continue to be consistent with my posting um <clears throat> so yeah i'm actually at 203 now yay so yeah my goal is to be at sorry if it's loud my goal is to be at 500 subscribers by the end of the year so i really like so that means i need it's four months left in the year i need to be having i need to have I need to gain 75 subscribers per month, but I want to challenge myself to grab to get 100 subscribers for this month. So, yeah. Oh, and also I signed up for another pop up shop. So I haven't done a pop up shop in like a month. Well, by the time that one hits, it'll be a month since I've done a pop up shop. About a month. Yeah. So um, that'd be exciting. Another pop up shop blog will be coming. Some, the pop-up shop isn't until September 12th, so the vlog obviously wouldn't be until sometime after that. So, those videos usually do pretty good. So, yeah, I'm about to just um, edit, edit some videos, plan out some, um, like, videos, ideas, and just get ready and get my post ready. Oh, yeah, I told y'all that i want to have a sale so i started working on my email i can show y'all let me pull it up um i have too much shit up right now i started uh, working on my email because i am going to i told you i wanted to do a sale i think i'm going to do buy one buy one and get one 25 percent off sets because i'm really trying to get rid of these damn sets like they gotta go mainly because all the sets i have i haven't released any new sets in a minute so that's what another really why i want to do a heavy discount for sets i might even do buy one get one 30 percent off shout out because they needs to go uh i have to look but let me show you i started um kind of working on the emails as y'all know i use clavio i've talked about it in a couple vlogs now but um, I'm gonna show y'all kind of like what they look like. Okay, so here's the email. I actually decided to do buy one, get one 30% off. So this is what the email is gonna look like. Buy one, get one 30% off. Use code SETS30 at checkout. It's gonna end Saturday. And then I just have a bunch of sets and then it just says treat yourself. So you can see what it looks like, the mobile version, you know, same thing. Um, and then I'm going to send out a couple different emails. I'm going to send this one out. I'm going to send one email and one text out on Thursday, one email out on Friday, 
two emails out on Saturday and another text out on Saturday. So, but I'm just gonna change the headers. So I made a couple of different headers. Um, and I make the headers in Canva. So um, this is gonna be the first one. And then like the next email, I have this header. The next email, I have this header. The next email, I have this header. So that way it's like basically the same email, but it's not, you know, so yeah, cause they might not read the first email, but then I also am going to change the website to probably just be like that picture or something like that. Um, but yeah, so that's what I'm about to continue to work on. Sorry for the beeping. That's my chicken. It's done. Time to eat. All right. So I don't think I'm going to, um, I need to fix this. I'm so irritated because my text thing, like it literally pops up like every five seconds. Like why, why are you doing this to me? I don't like that. Um, and I know my customers aren't gonna like happen to keep exiting out of this damn thing. But I do want to have a pop-up to be able to collect numbers. I mean, I don't know. Um, I know my SMS bump is connected to my Clavio, so I don't know if maybe I should make a pop, like my Clavio thing, collect phone numbers as well. And then just have it transfer over. I have to like test that out because then I only need like one pop up. Because I don't know why for this new, it only started doing that when I got this new theme. Like it literally, oh shit, literally pops up every 30 seconds. No, but what I, I turned the camera on to tell y'all that I don't think I'm gonna change my, um, I don't think I'm gonna change my website, um, like the actual header. Because another thing about this theme, um, I feel like I'm just complaining about the theme. I love the theme, but you don't like they. You can't have a mobile header and a a regular desktop header. If with my old theme, you could have like a mobile header and a desktop header. So I like that because then I could just make a, mo a desktop one, which would be like you know obviously it's bigger, and then I could make a separate mobile one. Um, with this one, you just have one, so you need to make sure that your one will look good on desktop and when it shrinks down to mobile will still look good. So, and it's really, the, because of how I have my pictures, like, it, it don't look good like that. If I was to put any of my sets, like, it just wouldn't look good. So I would just have to keep it as one of the new arrivals, but I still might change it to, like, um, I think right now it's high class or the high, the high class corset and the happy hour button up but I think I would change it to probably be the um scarlet top because I'm besides the sets um, my main focus for this week is tops so yeah I think that that'll be fine but I need to figure out um oh also okay I'm all over the place okay so I told y'all I can't do the thing I can't change the header so it's not going to be like a set for me to put, for me to advertise on the website that the sets are buy one get thirty percent off. But what this thing does have is that if you click on a collection, you can make it so that a pop up pops up just for that specific collection. So I'm going to make it so that when somebody clicks on sets, it'll pop up saying buy one get one thirty percent off. Um, but I'm not going to be able to do that until tomorrow morning um, because obviously I don't want to pop it up now because discount isn't available now. So I will try to remember to show y'all that in the morning once I make it available um once I like fix it to do all that um but right now I need to get this sms bump together and I use sms bump as my text messaging I hope y'all watch my video my previous video um well I don't know when y'all seen it but it's a previous previous video I will put the little thumbnail what it looks like over here but it is the um top five Shopify apps that I talk about this SMS bump app besides the problems I'm having right now the app is great I don't know if it's the app's fault or if it's my theme that's like messing with it that's causing this issue that I'm having but yeah I don't know if I should like delete the app and re-download it but I don't want to like mess up nothing so yeah but I'm gonna suggest continue to work I feel like this vlog is real chatty sorry um, and then I'll probably pop back on here later Okay, so this is a text message that's going to go out. As you can see, I have 56 subscribers. So, I'm trying to grow that. I would love to have, like, two to 300 by Black Friday. I know that's, like, 
a long shot because Black Friday is in like two months, but never say never. The goal is to have two to three hundred subscribers by Black Friday. But anyways, so as y'all see, it's just a little picture. I made this picture again in Canva. I use Canva for like all of my little graphics. I'm not the best, but I try. So here is a better, uh, hopefully y'all can see it. Uh, it's just, you know, buy one, get one, 30% off sets, use code sets30. Um, so yeah, I'm going to send this out in the morning. I'm going to wait till the morning to actually send it out. Um, but yeah, this is the message that's going to go out. And then I already have the emails. I'm going to send those out in the morning as well. Um, actually, I think I'm going to schedule this for 9 o'clock. But I'm going to send the emails out in the morning. Um, and then all I have to do now is just figure out, like, get posts ready for tomorrow.